Bitcoin is rising at two dollar today, while Ethereum is close to overtaking dollar three hundred seventy with stocks up as well. Ethereum seems to be rising a bit more, gaining on the ratio again after testing support following a bull run. Ethereum Bitcoin price of two thousand twenty for both Bitcoin and Ethereum. The new policy by the European Central Bank act that they too may target higher than two percent inflation may be one contributor. The reminder through the last debate of the tough decision that America has to make may be another. The dollar is also weakening and considerably losing significant ground against CME and other currencies. Dollar strength index of 2020. This dollar weakness has been going on for months now, but after a few gains, it has turned downwards again, except against Turkish lira (TRI), which is losing even more ground amid complex stress in all Turkish fronts. Its economy, however, is expected to grow by 0.3 percent, according to Berat Albayrak, the Turkish Treasury and Finance Minister. A slash try October 2020. Finally, there is Pakistan, an economy of dollar 315 billion, where a petition has been handed to overturn a central bank dictate that prohibited crypto trading in 2018. If using digital currency doesn't constitute an unlawful act, why is it not being allowed? Justice Muhammad Iqbal Kalora asked. That question gives a clear indication of what the result is very likely to be, as India's Supreme Court overturned a likewise dictate. Pakistan's economy is a lot smaller than India's, but they're a lot more neutral towards China. Thus, may have more of a chance of strategically using Bitcoin for international trade, like Iran might be doing. All in all, the overall picture looks decent for Bitcoin, and thus much of the crypto space as October enters. You can read full post on cryptofans. News link available in text below.